वेलकम व्यूअर्स दिस इज ग्रीन गाय टैरो एंड दिस इज योर जुलाई लव टरो प्रडिक्शन पिक अ कार्ड रीडिंग सो टेक अ डी ब्रेथ सिलेक्ट योर ऑप्शन फ्रॉम पायल नंबर वन टू एंड थ्री एंड वी विल स्टार्ट द रीडिंग फ्रॉम पायल नंबर वन वेलकम पायल नंबर वन दिस इज योर जुलाई लव टरो प्रडिक्शन पिक अ कार्ड रीडिंग दिस टाइम इट्स अ बिट डिफरेंट आई एम नॉट टेकिंग एनी ऑटल कार्ड दीज आर गोइंग टू बी ऑल टरो रीडिंग so let's begin okay pile number 1 your first card is the empress the divine feminine energy the next card is the knight of wands next you have the two of coins then we have the eight of coins next you have the princess of swords that is the page of swords next you have the hanged woman that is the hanged man card the major arcana we need space okay then we have the emperor okay and that is the extra card from the other deck you have two of pentacles next you have the star card let me put it this side next you have the hierophant okay so many major arcanas the empress the emperor the hanged man the hierophant the star July is a very important one in the matter of love for you pile number 1 as you are beginning the month with the empress energy the divine feminine energy this is probably you who is on the receiving end and your person is the knight of wands energy they are a bit child like rather than you they are enthusiastic they are energetic they are always on the go 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 but sometime they lose their energy and at that point of time you just have to carry the relation all by yourself because i can see the two of coins that tells me that you become someone who gives all the attention take care of the other person and invest more into the relationship rather than both of you putting in the efforts and the energies your next card is the 8 of pentacles this is the card that also tells me that you are a very hard working person and you are always on the giving end but in this month you've got the empress card in the beginning so you are going to find yourself changing the role the next card is the page of swords this is the stalker cards though you think the other person is not investing a lot or maybe that is the reality they are always stalking you for sure they are very watchful of your energies of your attention and probably they enjoy you being so much into them and in this month you are getting a bit tired and taking a back step it's a kind of energy that i'm seeing that now you want them to come in and come in strong and that is the hangman energy you are slowing down with your energies invested in this relationship or you are just shifting the situation a bit and that is working because that way 
the emperor comes in they just see that change in you and they understand that it is the time when they act up and definitely become the one that matches your energies and that way this divine union is definitely there for you your next card is the two of pentacles so you have to maintain this balance don't just give in so much and pamper them always 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 that they become a bit lazy that is what i'm getting for you the next card is the star card the wish fulfillment card and this card is telling that healing is definitely there for you and wish fulfillment is there as the hierophant is the very next card probably some of you at least are going to plan the union by tying the knot for others whatever the way you see the union you are taking that necessary step probably they are stepping up and there is a proposal happening for taking this relationship to the next level so things are looking pretty good for you pile number 1 you just have to be mindful about some situation and two of coins came twice so definitely be in the balance don't always just give 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 you need the same amount of return in the love so definitely don't ignore your need of that loving energy So pile number 1 this was your July love tarot prediction paper card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great July ahead welcome pile number 2 this is your July love tarot prediction paper card reading this time it is a bit different i'm not taking any oracle cards it is going to be all tarot reading so let's begin Pile number two. Your first card is Ace of Swords. Next, you have the High Priestess. Then you have the Six of Coins. Next, you have the Ace of Cups. Next, you have the Two of Cups. then you have the 7 of coins next you have the 10 of pentacles then you have the hanged man next you have the devil card and the final card is 9 of pentacles we are going to take clarifier for this devil card and then we will start the reading let's see what we get okay i'm going to take them here okay oh my god devil is clarified by devil this is happening for a while now in other readings this also happening Then we have the Ten of Swords. Next we have the Justice. Okay, thank God. Let clear them out of the way and begin. Okay, let's put them there. And <sighs> okay, let me adjust the camera a bit. pardon me let's begin now okay pile number 2 your first card is the ace of swords so there will be communication and that is going to clear out some blockage that was going on in this relationship and 
it is something that is going to bring in more information in your life regarding the person the situation that you are in this is also something the high priestess that is giving me the energy that probably you are keeping this relation a bit hush hush not sharing it with anyone or not sharing it with everyone this communication is going to bring in the balance that is also indicated with the six of coins that is telling me that you will find the equal amount of investment of energies previously someone was keeping quiet and not sharing much and that was creating the imbalance now it is going to be in balance and this is going to clear the air and that way the love will come in with the ace of cups new opportunities in the aspect of this relationship you will see coming in and you will see that the bond is definitely getting into newer depths because the very next card is the two of cups so divine union is definitely there you are going to be with them either it is going to be a date or you guys are going to spend some sorry some time on a trip and you will feel really happy and content together your next card is the seven of coins so this is going to definitely come in after a lot of struggle and it is going to be really sweet things are looking good at this point next you have the ten of pentacles so definitely the relationship is going to be stronger stable and probably some of you are going to see the commitment or some sort of proposal to taking this relationship to the next level but things will take time because the seven of pentacles is telling me that it is going to need time and work and the hangman also the card that tells about delays and time so time is something that is very much needed you need to ground your energy don't obsess and try to understand every aspect of the situation because yes it is love it is relationship sometime you don't feel like thinking of anyone else rather than you too but probably there are many situation around you guys that needs attention of you guys too either you have responsibilities or they have responsibilities that needs their prime attention at this point of time so this relationship have to go through a little more time to get the mature and desired to reach the mature and desired goals the next card is the devil card that was clarified with devil 10 of swords and justice so this situation this delay is going to definitely disappoint and disheartened you or both of you as you can see in this card these two person are tied up together but they are not looking at each other and they are both sad so that is the pain that is the hurt that you guys are not being able to be together as you desire to be together and that is the 10 of swords also it is too much hurtful but with the 10 of swords i can tell you that it is going to end and the justice is the final card so you will see 
that things will definitely come to a better and brighter future in time. You have to be patient. You have to have the patience to see through all that hardship that is ahead of you. The final card is the Nine of Pentacles. This is the card of empowerment, abundance, prosperity and you becoming mature, your relation becoming more mature. So through this hardship, through this challenges, disappointments, heartaches, you guys are definitely going to become more stronger in this relationship in the togetherness that is the clear indication with the final card being the nine of pentacles you don't have to worry things will work out but it will take time and being impatient and sad and too disheartened will not work you have to be patient to see the justice so pile number two, this was your July Love Tarot Prediction Pick a Card reading. If you like my reading, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share, subscribe and comment. Thank you very much for your participation. Have a great July ahead. Thank you. Welcome pile number three. This is your July Love Tarot Prediction Pick a Card reading. This time it is a bit different. I'm not taking any Oracle cards. It is going to be all Tarot reading so let's see what we have for you pile number three okay pile number three your first card is five of coins next you have the hanged man hanged man came in all three piles next you have the will of fortune then you have the high priestess okay next you have the nine of coins next you have the knight of coins then you have the four of wands that is your extra card from this deck next you have the king of wands then you have the world card next you have the six of pentacles you have two extra cards here ace of pentacles and the temperance okay pile number three whatever was going on previously it was not happy that i can tell with the five of coins i can tell you were feeling alone heartbroken and you were in pain things were difficult in the relationship situation things were really difficult but that's about to change the hanged man is the card that tells that you are saying to yourself enough is enough you are changing your ways Probably you have some sort of knowledge at this point of time regarding the situation, regarding the relationship and you came to realize that you weren't thinking straight. You were thinking the situation might be something else and actually it is something else. So this is something that is going to take a while but you will came to the realization and you will change your point of view and that will give you the clarity that you need your next card is the will of fortune so time is also changing as you are changing your way of thinking your thoughts is sorry your thoughts are going to reflect in your energy and that is going to bring in the change you are going to feel the abundance the good luck good fortune coming in in the matter of love you are going to become the empowered energy of the high priestess who knows better and have the ability
to manifest their dreams into reality and they are very empowered and there is nothing that can stop them they are irresistible they have it all because the very next card is also the nine of pentacles you are becoming more gorgeous as your confidence rises up you are wiser you are mature and abundant and blessed and here comes the knight of pentacles yes the knight of coins they are a bit slow in the energy that i can tell because the knight of coin is the slowest knight of the tarot so things are going to be a little slow because the hangman is also indicating the delay and the relationship will start for sure but definitely it is going forward after considering so many things i don't know what at this point of time but you guys are thinking about many things and then deciding upon the path ahead but the path ahead is something that is giving me the energy that why you guys need to think a lot probably you guys are thinking of taking this relationship to the next level that's why the four of wands is here this is the card that tells about tying the knot for some for others this is also telling me that whatever you guys are doing at this point of time with this relationship you are definitely going to stand the test of time because you are laying a very strong foundation with those four pillars your next card is the king of wands so love is there and the passion is there too you guys are definitely feeling very passionate in this relationship you are empowered and not being dependent to any one you are equally empowered together and alone too and if someone is lacking any any energy or idea or anything in this relationship the other one is definitely leading them the path and this goes vice versa so this is a very healthy and strong relationship the next card is the world card so yes you are thinking of creating a world together and ending whatever the past was going on previously and this world card is bringing in the abundance prosperity in your life your next card is a six of pentacles that also gives me the energy of equal amount of investment in the in the relationship energetically love is definitely there there is no doubt about it and the balance that you need that is also there the next card is ace of pentacles this is also an indication of a proposal to leveling up the relationship or you guys are going to see more stability and growth in the relationship things are looking really good the final card is the temperance this is the card that tells about you guys maturing in the relationship more and more each day and having the energies balanced and you are learning from the past as you are moving forward and you are very much willing and ready to give this relationship the time it needs to become in a more mature level or state so pile number 3 this was your july love tarot prediction pick a card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great july ahead so viewers this was your July love tarot prediction pick a card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great july ahead